a governorship aspirant in Kogi State, and a serving senator, Smart Adeyemi, representing Kogi West, has challenged other aspirants to a two-hour debate on national television to tell the people of the state what they have to offer. Smart made the declaration when he picked his expression of interest and nomination form at the National Secretariat of the All Progressives Congress, APC, in Abuja. He said his wide experiences has given him an edge over many others who picked the gubernatorial forms. Our antecedents speaks for us. In the first instance, I would have loved the situation where all the contestants, and let me challenge all those who have taken form to contest governorship election in Kogi State, that I will want us to have a two hours live television network um, uh, debate so that they will tell Nigerians what they have not done in time past and what they want to do. And I will be telling Nigerians what I have done and why I merit to be the next governor of Kogi State. When you talk about someone who should govern is complexly like state, uh, like Kogi, you'll be looking for somebody who, have, who has had the experience of, of, um, of, uh, of uh, knowing the nooks and corners of this country because Kogi is a mini Nigeria. You'll be talking about the, um, the, the, the uncountable number of, um, of tribes in Kogi state. You'll be talking about how complex the state is. You'll be talking about the needs and the aspiration of the people. For me, I'm uh, sufficiently uh, educated enough, experienced enough to govern Kogi state, to build on the foundation that is on ground and build Kogi to a level of envy, a level where uh, people will be attracted for investment. I will leverage on my knowledge, on my experience as a third time senator in the Senate, and I'm the first uh, um, indigenous of Kogi State that is running a third time in the Senate. So you can use that as a basis of, of uh, assessing my competence and my acceptability. Meanwhile, pharmacist Abdul Karim Mohamed Jamil Asuku, who is the chief of staff to Governor Yahya Bello, after picking his gubernatorial form, assured the people of consolidating on the achievements of his principal already delivered. I humbly present myself before all the good people of the United States to serve them, to consolidate on the numerous achievements of His Excellency Yahya Bebe, to consolidate on the security achievement of His Excellency to consolidate on the infrastructure development that have been so achieved by the new direction administration of his excellency to consolidate on the women and youth empowerment that his excellency have brought to bear in Kogi state to consolidate on all inclusiveness style of leadership that his excellency have enshrined in Kogi state to consolidate on women inclusiveness in the system of governance. The constitution of our party stated 35% affirmative action. But His Excellency have achieved more than 40% in Kogi State today. So that is our consolidation. And to consolidate, most importantly, on the God-fearing style of leadership, justice, equity, and fairness that have brought development to the news and crannies of Kogi State. Today, Kogi State, we are looking out for who have the interests of the people at heart. It is now the interest of Kogi State first, as against the old norm of tribal difference, ethnic difference, religious difference, or even political appreciation dichotomy. More indigenous of Kogi State have also joined the governorship race to compete in the primary election scheduled to hold on the 3rd of April 2023.